Hey people, I got some more gold. But this is Appease, the bull Appease, the highest god of Egypt. And the story is, he wasn't born from other bulls. He was created by the gods and was left here for the people to worship, to appease. That's where appease comes from. But the name's been twisted, and it used to look like this. And that was pronounced a P-H, Fape, Fape. So when you're reading this ancient language, you have to watch for all these marks, you know. Because a friend, F-R-E-N, you would think that's where your word friend come from. But it's actually obsolete for a stranger. But when you put the, the mark on it, like this, well then you read it backwards, you know, and it's a, a near friend. And that's a near stranger. And so a stranger isn't correct. The, just a person but a near person is a friend you know with the mark on it near friend and why this come up while I was searching for Nemo's I haven't a clue you know the only explanation is God did it we don't know so this old bull hippies it was fine for the old people the old Egyptians it was there before but when the Romans took over you know, they were not going to have their people worshipping animal gods. And so they turned it into serapes with these many spellings. And so to appease the people, serapes was depicted as a Greek in appearance, but with Egyptian trappings. You know, they left him his old hippie hair and, and give him pothead. And that's where you were pothead and hippies comes from. And so rather than having the people worshiping many gods, you know, Ptolemy was pushing this one, you know, to unify the Greeks and Egyptians in his realm. And the cultus of Serapis was spread as a matter of deliberate policy. And so cultus, you know, you would think it has to do with cult, but it actually has to do with the vocabulary. They were spreading the language in order to take over. And so in 389, a Christian mob led by Pope Theophile. In the last couple movies, that's what that was about. You know, the O-Files is the way it's spelled in the Greek. And it had to do with their system of filing the O-File. And this mob destroyed the Serapium of Alexandria, but the cult survived until all forms of pagan religion were suppressed under Theodosius, you know, still the Theo, the god. They think they're god of Phylus and god of Dosis. Serapis mentioned in the Babylonian Talmud as Serapis, an idol thought to have been named after the biblical Joseph. And many scholars think the Serapis was the origin of Jesus. And best chances are they're right being that this first book of Jesus Ben Sirah was from the second century BC. So what got me on this subject, that last movie I was talking about, Luke, it only comes up three times. Oh, Lucas. And I saw it come up here in this letter of Philemon. You know, the Philemon. So I went to look at that. And so this isn't a book, this is just a single letter. And it's called Philemon. And, and on the the ancient Greek, you know, it's the force, P-R-O-S, four S, the force Philomona. And that was my grandmother's name. She was a Philomene. They say meaning love, but um, I found that there's two different spellings of this file in, in the Greek. But down at the bottom of it, where Luke comes up in this last little paragraph called Additional Greetings, and I noticed it started with that word that begun the last time that Luke was mentioned. You know, they say greets you, Epaphras, fellow prisoner. My, you know, my fellow prisoner in Christ Jesus. Is, is Christ Jesus the name of the prison? You know, Christians say that Jesus is my rock. And, you know, rock is the ancient term for prison prisoners been busting rocks at the rock forever and up at the top here when this letter started you know it starts with the police and this is the word for 
police is where your word police comes from. You know, a P A W L, a Paul. You know, this is a Paul here in the blue, and its job is to police the spool to keep it from running out when you take a break. You know, if the man cranking on it or or the machine gives out, you know, the Paul polices the spool and keeps all the line from running back out free. You know, the Paul keeps it from being free, the police. And this a prisoner, you know, they got that misinterpreted too. This decimios, this is where your word disseminate comes from. You know, dis is abroad and dissemin comes from the seed. You know, to spread the seed, disseminate. You know, to police the spread. So they totally got everything turned backwards in this letter. You know, in this word for brother, Adel foes. Adel means worthy, and foes are enemies. You know, a worthy enemy it means a royal enemy, the royal enemy of Philemon, the Philemon. You know, the O of a worthy enemy to Philemon make. And so this is going to be a good letter to read because it has all of the names in there. Like I say, all the names aren't names. They have meanings. And so back to the bottom, this word for greets, you know, it's as pays it to make, as pays it to make. And it actually reads backwards first with this, with this mark. And it's yet is a pass as pays it to make. Yet is a pass. Yet means, you know, not yet. It has, has to do with time. And it means future, you know, on the way. Yet is. Yet is a pass as pays it to make. See, ser, rap, rapees. The see, ser, rapees. You see, it's the Q, the P H A P E. Serape. S A R. R Q A P E, the serape. You see the mark here tells you to read it backwards first. You know a P's with a with a Q P H A P E. You know the Christian mob destroyed the serapium. You know the Simon Ben son of Jesus Yahshua, Ben son of Elizer, Ben son Sarah, the serapium. So Theodosian, you know, sent this Christian mob to destroy the Serapeum in 385, you know, after this decree of, uh, of the Council of Nicaea. You know, that's when Rome was deciding what books would be left in the Bible and which ones would be taken out. But they had to leave certain books in to have better control of the people. And so they had to go destroy this ancient knowledge because it just didn't fit in with the timeline they were trying to force on us. And, and what this means is the word Christian 2,000 years ago had a totally different meaning than it does today. You know, you saw this, this word Eusebius in that last movie, last time Luke come up, this name come up. So the reason you see minor spelling changes in, in most of the words is mainly because Sometimes they read forwards and backwards. And so it's the Serapi Papyrus. Papyrus, that's the, the ancient Egyptian term for legal papers. The Serapi Papyrus. You know, P-A-Q-R-A-R-S. The Papyrus. And this Serapis Papyrus looked like this. And it's in the British Museum now. And it's a, it's a letter about conflict concerning... The cultivation of land in African Egypt, Lower Egypt, Saqqara, and Serapium. You know, it's it's all about stealing land is what it is. And the way you do it, you know, you first you get your religious cult in there. And you do that by changing the language. You know, that's what's going on right now. They're trying to change the definition of woman. And they're trying to change the definition of sex. And they're trying to change the definition of biology. And they've already changed the definition of vaccine. And so what this writer's saying is, Yet is a pass as pays it to see the Serapis 
papyrus. It means yet is it too. I haven't yet seen. I haven't made a pass to go see the Serapis papyrus yet. I haven't seen exactly what's written in it. Oh, Senecum Alatos moi. And so this is, is O oh, is to see or of. And Sena means together. Like a synagogue means together, Gog to lead, the Sena when you come together. And so Sena become Alatos. Alatos is where your word Altos comes from on a high note. And together come a high note. To come together on a high note. Moi, me. So that lets you know that the writer's French. And this this is Ben, you know, the N E is B and then the N. You know, it's so it's in the seed or in the cycle. And it's the same as you were looking at uh, the name of Ben Sarah, Ben Jesus, Ben Sarah, all those Ben's in there, son of, son of, son of, telling all his his bloodline is what it was doing. And so it's in the cycle as in Ben as in a time, but it's in the seed as in the son of. And then the hardest word to define in the Bible. And so this is the Chiro is taught. You know, the XR in the Hebrew they'll say XR is your enemy. And uh, the Risto, if you just read it like this, X Risto, Risto is Romeo. If you were wanting to raise the R flag up on your mast, you would tell the signalman to to raise Risto. You would tell him raise R. It's like on the radio we say Romeo. You know, they used to say Risto. And so the Risto just means the R. And so this can have many meanings like all the other words. And that's where your word aristocrat come from. You see they don't break it down. It just comes straight from the French. They don't know how that word come together. But you know crap, you know that's government and it comes from the ancient uh, Vedic word. You know the Pallades and that was the governor when the Vedic astrology was written and that's where your word critic. Critic come from. The cratic. The govern. You know and a wrist is a risto is risto is head. A head govern aristocrat the head govern and it means you know when the vedic astrology was written that the easter sun rose in critic but it looks like the way it's used here it's derogatory you know it's the chiro the enemy is is taught t-o and then the other way t-t two t's you know the enemy is it Ought, O-T-T, you know, ought, ought meaning mad or frantic, or supine of Oda, you know, meaning empty, waste, desolate, old high German empty. The Chiro is too, the enemy is it ought, is it empty, search of Vus, V-O-O-S. Vus, meaning weak, feeble, unsteady, immoral, rotten, corrupt, evil, bland, play tasteless. You know, it's just not good. Weak and feeble. You know, the enemy is art search of Vus, of the weak and feeble. Hitch, H-I, and then hitches. The hitches, O-V-O, o -V -O, is the egg. You know, this is the Chiro. This was the enemy in the Hebrew Bible. And so it was around before Christ. It was their enemy. And it was the Roman army. Coming from this base word, XR, is pronounced Tsar, T Z A R. You know, an unchecked ruler, a Tsar, a Caesar, a Kaiser. A Tsar is a plant to head your enemies. So, uh,. They say that the main purpose of the Nicene Council was mandating a uniform observance of the date of Easter. Well, that's reason enough to send your armies out. And so I was scanning over this ahead of here, 
and it might tell in here why we color Easter eggs and the clue is this word die they give it some other meanings it usually means through and they change the meanings several times in this writing for the sake of why we die and the line before that you know they just say it means by when when they always say that die means through to channel an act through and it's dies and then ova ovo is an egg and then backwards and it's the the plead adele fee a worthy fee to plead a worthy fee plead is when you ask of something before court is o definition of plead to plead a del fee a worthy fee you know fee f fee is iron but it's albanian coming from the vulgar latin fides or religion of fides that i trust or faith a worthy belief a worthy faith but they might be reading that Q is a, a K as in cleed, is to clothe, you know, to, to dress, to dies over the cleed of worthy fee. And this next line, the Marcos, it give me a better idea of the word word. You know, Amar, the M moves over from Amarcos. You know, ma amar is the word for said in the Hebrew Bible. It give me a better idea what that meant here from a Marcos, the Mark. But this is just a short letter. I believe I'm going to read the whole thing a couple of times. And I believe it's going to help me figure out what a bunch of these names mean. Before I go, I want to holler at Folk and Ellie. All of your comments have been taken down. I don't know if they took your channel down. I know you don't make movies, but everywhere you commented on my movies, it's uh, they're all gone. You possibly said something that you're not supposed to say. I don't know. Don't forget. Hurry, 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 hurry. I won't forget. Alright, I'm going to cut this off here. Good day.